Hello everyone, it's your lovely Abby Dagren. Abby 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 And welcome back to my podcast. This will also be on my YouTube channel. And today we'll be speaking on reciprocal relationships. Please stay tuned. I did promise this video on my YouTube channel. So reciprocal relationships is something that's very important. It's basically a mutual action between people is felt given or done in return. So basically a relationship that is both ways. So if you do something for that person, then automatically they would do something for you. Not like in a selfish way, but it's just a transactional relationship. And I know when you do things for people, you're not wanting something in return. You usually do it from the kindness of your heart. However, if you're in a friendship or relationship with per- with a person, you would expect for them, if you wanted something, to do that for you too. So I will be going into the importance of reciprocal relationships. I think we've all come to a time in society where a lot of people are trying to do the best for themselves and putting themselves first. However, there should always be people in your corner who you love and respect. However, if that's not reciprocated, then that can really do a lot to your your mental health. And you feel as though things are done in vain. Now that's not something that you want to do. In a reciprocal relationship, you have you, me, and you have the, the middle line, which is we. Whenever you're in a relationship with someone, you should want it to be reciprocal because when one person is doing all the work and there's nothing in return, then sometimes that person will become very upset and very sad that what they've given out is not being given right back to them. In reciprocal relationships, it's also important that you have one because A lot of people aren't going to really respect you if you don't expect the same from that person. And they will show you each and every time that they don't have that respect for you. Which is sad, but it's true and unfortunate. What I've learned in life is that you have to teach people or show people how to treat you. Because if people feel as though bringing 20% to a relationship is that's it whether that's a friendship or a marriage, then that's what they feel so they can give to you. And that will really be an issue for you because you know your worth and you know that you deserve more than what you're being given. And that will cause a lot of conflict because that person thought it was okay to abuse you and not give you the same love and respect that you give to that other person. So that's why having reciprocal relationships are very important. Ways for you to make sure that you have a reciprocal relationship is that there may be some relationships where you don't even have to tell the person. That person naturally loves you and they want the best for you and will do everything that needs to be done to make you happy. However, there are other times when you may have to tell people, you know what, the way you're talking to me, the way you're treating me, the The amount of effort I put into doing things for you is not reciprocated, so I cannot continue to do that. Or sometimes you don't even have to say that at all. If you're struggling with something or if that person who's not giving you that same level of respect or reciprocal relationship needs help, just say, you know what, I'm I'm busy, I have things to do, and keep moving with your life. Give them the same energy they give you. And I know this sounds a little harsh, however, it's very important because you have to have boundaries, which is going to be my next podcast, is on boundaries and how important they are. Because people will walk over them if you don't have any. And it can be hard for your mental health because you know that you are top tier. You know that you are very important. However, you're like, oh my goodness, this person does not have that same feeling for me so that's when you have to walk up walk out and just go because your life is important and people treating you the same way you treat yourself or you treat them is very important 
I hope you guys like this small little podcast slash YouTube video that I put up. I will actually continue to do video slash podcasts like this because I like this format. Thank you guys so much for listening or watching. You guys can follow me on all my social media accounts under Abby Dagren, which is Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat, Abby Dagren88, and TikTok, Abby Dagren. Please like this video and subscribe, and please share this podcast and video with all your friends who need this. Love you all. Please stay safe. Goodbye.